The economic crisis of 2007 to 2008 has had an uneven impact across countries. Some saw dramatic declines in economic activity and sharp increases in unemployment, while others saw only modest changes in employment and growth. In many cases, the peak to trough fall in quarterly gross domestic product GDP, was greater than the average fall in recessions over the previous 50 years. In some cases, the decline was nearly 13 percent. Impact of Economic Crisis on Income Inequality The United States has experienced a dramatic rise in income inequality since the 1970s, and this trend has attracted increased attention from economic observers. Rising income inequality has become a concern for many economists because it is one of the key factors that contributes to secular stagnation or a chronic shortfall in aggregate demand. This phenomenon occurs when lower-income households redistribute income to higher-saving households at the top, slowing demand growth. The resulting resulting income gap is likely to make it harder for advanced economies to recover from a recession. Income inequality makes it harder for advanced economies to spend their way out of downturns, and it makes it more difficult to draw down public debt once a recovery has begun. Impact of Economic Crisis on Social Innovations the current economic crisis is prompting debates about the equities of existing systems, attracting attention to alternative economic narratives, and accelerating social innovations. While concern over the negative impacts of the economic crisis on social values has waned, counter-movements have emerged, combining concerns about social and environmental damage, tax evasion, and production systems. The impact of the economic crisis on social innovation initiatives has been reflected in many recent academic and policy discussions. In Western Europe, for instance, economic turbulence has fueled debates and initiatives to realize fundamental transformation. The economic crisis of 2007 to 2008 has had an uneven impact across countries.